Most women are attracted to you, bro, for the same thing that they don't want you to have. Can you guess what that is? Your power and your self-control. You know, they are attracted to you because you have you have a powerful mindset. You have an abundance mindset. You feel like they can be replaced and they don't feel like they can infiltrate your inner circle. They don't feel like they can infiltrate your bubble. See what I'm saying? So they're attracted to you because of that, but at the same time, they don't want you to have it because they're attracted to you because they want to take it from you. That's the whole game, trying to get you to submit. Once they feel like you beneath them, game over. They gone and cheating, they getting smart, disrespect, all that. So they're the same, they're, most of them are attracted to the same thing. They're attracted to what they can't have. And as long as they feel like they can't have your mind, as long as they feel like they can't have your, your attention, your validation, then they, they're going to act right because they try to figure out what can I do to lower your, to get through. They want to get through. And those guys who have lowered it in the past, I'm quite sure you know some of them guys and you may be that guy. A lot of them guys, they heard the same story. She said, um, it's not you, it's me, my feelings change. So they say if their feelings change once they feel like they got your heart because they feel like they can do better. Better to, better to most women is a man who's not thinking about them. That's why Pookie and Ray Ray able to get him because it's not, because he dust his drawers smell like sardines. Pookie and Ray Ray's drawers smell like sardines, but the women still deal with him. They wash him up like he a baby. Trust me, Pookie and Ray Ray is my cousin. I know. I will observe them since I was little. Pookie and Ray Ray get treated like a baby and a man without having a job. He don't need a job. He don't need a lot of stuff. He don't need a lot of stuff. But he don't care. The fact that he don't care about the underwear, he don't care about impressing a woman, he don't care what she do, he don't care if she what she like, her preferences, she, he don't care about her trifling ways, he not going to check her on nothing. He's not checking her. That's why he stay attractive to them. Because he makes them feel comfortable even when they wrong. That's how nonchalant and careless he is. He can't teach. Only thing he can teach a kid is how not to worry. Pookie and Ray Ray's stress level is low. Pookie and Ray Ray keep all his hair. He don't stay, he don't be stressed. Pookie, ain't nothing stressing Pookie and Ray Ray out. He'll be at the liquor store with no problem at 7-Eleven, asking for a dollar with brand new Jordans on and she bought them after, before she kicked them out. I'm Alan Ray there. Follow me on Instagram, Alan Ray there. So that's when you can set up a consultation. Let me know how much time you want. Or you can ask me for the latest book, The Blueprint, Men's Guide to Conquering Heartless, Controlling, and Selfish Women in 2023. If you want that book, message me on Instagram. I'll email it to you. Price $29.90. Women date men they don't like, but they chill with men that they're sexually attracted to. So you got to be, most of them do that, man. And when you ever hear the term, I date with a purpose or something like that, you know, I don't want to waste my time. That means she's been getting ran through by guys that she thinks she's sexually attracted to or whatever. And they ain't been doing nothing but smashing her. And the guys that she not sexually attracted to, that's probably good men, and the reason why she's not sexually attracted to them is because they're showing strong interest. She's sexually attracted to anybody, any man that's not showing strong interest. There's nothing special about him or unique. There's nothing that she's compatible with about him.
There's nothing that she's compatible with about him. But she just attracted to his nonchalantness and his emotional unavailableness. So that's why she, she'll go over his house. But you got to take her on 100 dates just to get the man who done nothing leftovers. So less gets more and more is less when it comes to this world and with women in most cases, not all. So you got to understand that, you know, when you, she dating with a purpose, what, what have she been doing? What have you been doing? If you've been dating with, if you're dating with a purpose, what have you been doing? You know, what have you been doing? If you're dating with a purpose, what have you been doing? You're just dating with a purpose? What you been doing at first? Smashing? Oh, that's what they've been doing. That's what they've been doing, man. They've been smashing, you Then they, they look in the mirror and they say, oh... This is getting flat. That don't look the same. My face ain't as fresh as no more. Don't look as young and vibrant. Uh-oh. Time to find a good man. I'm, at, I'm about to be at my last leg. I'm getting 35, 30, 35, 40. Between 30 and 40, they get a rude awakening. Women get a rude awakening between 30 and 40. And then they want a good man. They want a good guy, then. They want a good man. So don't be that good man and just get the leftovers, man. You know, be strong and firm and direct. Tell them what you want. If they are, they gonna either say yes or no. You know, they either gonna say yes or no. Do not be scared to hear no. And if they ain't gonna do you no good. Most of them are under the same software. They are downloaded with the same software they are not unique and they are not different they're under the same software so it's just to let you know that's how they work they're under the same software it's nothing new no new tricks They are programmed to appreciate whoever giving them the less, the least. There's nothing more unattractive to a woman than a nice man that's available. She's going to date you, though. She'll date you. She might take one bite out of that food, and she's going to come home and bring it to you. Women are attracted to men that are smashed that are currently smashing other women. They don't want no man who ain't getting none. You think they want a man who ain't getting none? No. They want to see if they can take a man that's already getting some. They want to see if they can take him away from a woman who he's already smashing. Why you think they're always in triangles? Why you think they're always getting cheated on? They already got with a guy that was already dealing with. If a man is not dealing with a woman, if they're dealing with a single guy, you know how much energy that is um, he gonna, that he gonna give her. If he, if she's the only, if she's the only woman he giving attention to, he gonna be pouring that on her. He gonna be all over her, and then she gonna say he's a bugaboo, he's too aggressive. That's because you, if you only got one pair of shoes, you gonna be so protective and over those shoes and that's why some men are aggressive because they're only dealing with one woman that's why he's so consistent always texting you always on time always always want to see you because he care about you because you all he have but you say that's what you want but then when you get it when you get it you don't appreciate it you run away from it. You're scared of it. So you can't really go by what women say they want because you'll be nuts 
if you go by what they say they want. Because once you give them what they want, still not enough. It's just not enough. So, that's what happens, man. Women want men that's already jumping in and out of another woman or women. They feel like he's special. May not be special. That's why they're always getting with guys that's already married and relationships and stuff like that. They don't mind being, they like women like to start off the side chick. They're more comfortable starting off the side chick. It gives them something to work for. And they respect the man that already don't need them. He don't need them, he got somebody. Whether he's happy or not, he got somebody. He's claiming somebody, living with somebody, smashing somebody. Women claim that's what they want. And then every time they get it, they don't they don't like a man that's single. <laughs> then they complain about that which they got into. They love playing victim. I repeat, women love playing victim. They never take accountability. It's always somebody else's fault. Is it somebody else's fault you put that good man in the friend zone? Is it somebody else's fault that you didn't give him give him the, the, the cupcakes? But you gave the man that's married or or that's dealing with all those women and cupcakes that could have a sexual disease. Is it somebody else's fault that you did that? Is it somebody else's fault that you now see that man that you put in the friend zone with a, with a woman that looked better than you, ten times better than you, that's smiling and appreciate him, and you still single, dealing with married men and men that's jumping around? You got a vaginal disease. And you're getting vaginal disease and bacteria and stuff because he, all these different guys, he, that's, they hump all these different chemicals and all these different crouch areas and bacteria from crouch areas leaking in you residue from because you like dealing with guys that's dealing with others. And if, even if you dealt with a guy that was dealing with just you, you wouldn't appreciate him. You look at him, you try to play mind games because you look at him, you feel like you're above him because you're going to think he can't get nobody else because you got him when he, had, when he wasn't dealing with nobody else. So you don't really want a single man. You want a player or a man that's in a situation already. You don't really want a clean slate man. Unless you want to use him. And then you won't respect him in most cases if if he is single. So it's all for you. It's not about him. All you want to bring to the table is your cupcakes. You ain't want to get... That's it. That's all you... Ain't no real support. Ain't no real love. Ain't no agape. I'm Alan Ray, and hit me up in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this video. Don't forget to press like and subscribe. Check out the description box, because you can make your Pookie and Ray Ray anthem TikTok Instagram video challenge. Um, send the videos or the TikTok link or the Instagram link to storetry at yahoo.com, along with your cash app, so my team can put some money in your account. Um, video, 30 seconds, 60 seconds, it don't matter. But um, people getting paid, man. We're going to do it a little longer, so. I better hurry up and make your videos now while, while they're still giving out money. <laughs> um, much love to you. Hit me up in the comment section. First, like and subscribe. Pray to Jesus. Give Jesus your all because they ain't too much stuff on this planet. They really love you. They play mind games. Much love to you. Vibe give off too much wisdom. You know why? You might know why. Think about it. If a man is too wise and she got the devil in her, how he gonna have the spirit of discernment? Because all wisdom comes from God. So he's gonna have the spirit of discernment and he's gonna be able to see what? Bullish! He's gonna be able to see that bull. So. They can't get over on the man that can see who they really are. You know how irritating it is for somebody to see you naked? You thinking you covered and you think you think a person can't see something when they can see you? Imagine somebody being able to look right through you. Everything you do, they know why you're doing it. You know how strange that it feel if you full of baloney and somebody can see you? Well, we, women can sense when a man is, and it, which is rare, but it's some guys out here that can see straight through women. 
he may not never say nothing, but it's in his demeanor. And they can sense that this guy, wisdom is strong. And some of all him feel like I'm not going to be able to get older. Why do I feel so intimidated by this guy? Most guys I can control. Most guys I don't feel intimidated by. You know what I'm saying? So they trying to figure out why they feel the way they do around you. They don't know you. So what happens is they they saying I shouldn't feel intimidated by this guy because I usually dominate guys with my beauty and I can talk to them any kind of way and they just take it because they can't wait to get in the bed with me. Yinka, yinka, yinka. So most guys willing to take their manhood and put it in their back pocket because he wants some yammy. He wants some of that used up, blown out yammy that a guy that last week had that was jumping on and sweating on and everything else on. But she got a whole new outfit on, got a whole new hairdo on now, makeup, looking like a oompa loompa, oompa loompa, yippa dee dow. I got makeup and I'm looking like a clown. What you gonna look when you take it off? Anyway, a lot of times people keep putting on other costumes and making themselves with all these new clothes and all this stuff, it's because they feel used up or they're trying to cover up their soul. They feel used up. They feel washed up. They, got, they feel old. So what do people do when they want to feel new and fresh? They buy. They consume. They hide behind the new clothes. Nothing wrong with feeling fresh, but it's better being fresh than just feeling fresh. Especially if you're a woman, because you're supposed to be the help. If I'm dirty, you're supposed to help me be clean, but if we both dirty, then we'll come. <laughs> I want to do what you do. It's not fair. I want to be like you. If you can do it, I can too. If you can if you can take a leak standing up, I can too. Because we are equal. We are equal. We equal, huh? We equal? Okay. Hey Jesus, they said she said we equal, Jesus. Well she wasn't she supposed to be my help, Jesus? Aren't she supposed to be my help? But she don't want to be my help, Jesus. She want to be my equal. Is it going to work out that way, Jesus? Hmm? I'm asking you, Jesus, is it going to work out? Or is it going to be a disaster? He'll tell me soon. Anyway. I'm Alan Reagan. Now. Everything you need is in the description box for my albums, shirts, songs, books. Many of you, many you want to know if I wrote a book. I have books out. My latest one is in the description box. So those of you who like to read, everything you need is in the description box. Even my Instagram, which I highly recommend you to follow. Everybody watch this video. Press that one button. A link is in the description box. You want a one-on-one -on -one session with me about something that's going on in your life, personally, relationship, friendship, family, coworker, insecurity, your health. You want my opinion on it? Send me a message to my Instagram. I'll give you the details and we can set up a time. Press the like and subscribe for all newcomers to Reunion Nation. We welcome you here. Here is where we Speak that which is uncommon, that which has been blinded for a long time. Here is no matrix. We are out of the matrix here. Everything is completely naked, and it's only going to get deeper and more intimate. I'm Alan Ray now. Much love to you. Press like, subscribe. 
Don't forget to pray, 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 pray. None of us are perfect at all. So we got to pray and be thankful. I'm out, y'all. Talk to you soon. Here's a simple trick on how the average man can increase his interaction with beautiful women 80%. He can actually, with this trick, he can actually interact with beautiful women. They're seeking his validation. Even if he's broke, even if he's overweight, underweight, short, even if he look like a porker pie, yes, this trick works. This trick works. But you only can get this trick from me. Alan Ray in there. You have to follow me on Instagram. It's $40 for this trick. This is not for everybody. I wouldn't recommend it. I wouldn't want to put this in everybody's hands. But those individuals who would like more interaction with beautiful women, this really works. You can look at my um, resume. I know I'm not the ugliest dude in the world. I'm not the shortest guy in the world. But I've told my friends who are considered looking like porker pies and they are five foot six, five two, and it works. Trust me. Um, I really didn't want to put this out there. I should, I was going to charge a hundred, but hey, in these times where these <laughs> women are off the chain, they acting like this, hey, I just charge 40. For you guys that want this information, that want more interaction with women, you having problems, this is guaranteed to work for sure. I'm Alan Rillionaire. Stay prayed up in Jesus' name. Message me on Instagram at Alan Rillionaire Show if you want this technique to be added to your um, demeanor, your repertoire. You know, I would uh, recommend you not to share this information with every man but some guys already know this unconsciously they picked up on it from just observation but you'd be surprised after all this 90 percent of guys still don't have a clue on this trick on how to always keep women around you all it takes is you to do this one time with i can't i tell you when you I'll tell you during the uh, during the, during the consultation. But uh, I'm Alan Ray and follow me on Instagram at Alan Ray and show. Press like, subscribe, hit the bell. Uh, watch the next video all the way through. All right. So stay prayed up in Jesus' name. Subscribe to my other YouTube channel and everything is in the description box. But uh, you want you need to know this trick right now. Moving on to this new era. This trick is gonna come in handy, so a lot of guys won't be lonely. And this is this. Just get in their heads like that. It's like cutting a switch on in their heads and beautiful women that you desire. You're going to say, I can't believe this. And everybody's going to be shocked. Don't tell everybody. You know, maybe you can tell your best friend or something, but maybe I just think you should just keep it to yourself, honestly. But I'm going to tell you for a fee of $40, but I recommend you to keep it to yourself or somebody that's really, only tell somebody that's really, really you think your best of best friends that's really, really worthy or somebody you feel that's having a hard time getting interaction with women, okay? I'm Alan Rayner. Talk to you soon. I'm out. I'm telling you guys, I know a secret trick that can keep beautiful women chasing you. I'm telling you, it works. It don't matter how short, tall, how ugly you think you are. It don't matter. I got a trick that you can use. And if you want to try it out, it's going to work. It's going to work. You know what I mean? Sometimes it, it, it magnitudes on a more powerful level, but it's always, you're always going to get something good out of this, this trick, man. Uh, it, it really works. So if you want this trick, um, message me on Instagram and Alan Reagan and show. Um, it's $40. Yes, it costs. Um, same way you got to pay for a book or magazine and stuff like that. You know, it's a business. Um, it does cost, but you will get results out of it. Um, so message me on Instagram at Alan Rillionaire Show. And let me know you want the trick. Okay. Instagram link is also in the description box.
So get this, and uh, if you're having problems, and you all, you always wanted, you know, beautiful women to be around, you wanna know how it feel to get chased by beautiful women, um, every man deserves that feeling, you know, then this trick is gonna put you in a, and you're gonna look at it in a whole nother light, or you're gonna see the difference, and the, you're gonna observe like, wow, this, I can't believe this actually working. Message me on Instagram if you want this trick at Allen Rillionaire Show. Um, it's $40 um, to cash out PayPal. Um, so yeah, just message your boy on Instagram. You should be following me on Instagram anyway. And uh, press like, subscribe, hit the bell. Make sure you subscribe to my other YouTube channel also. If you have any ideas or anything you want me to talk about on the videos, um, hit me up. Also, make, a, make sure you make a consultation with me because we got a super discount on the consultation this week.